dreaming about stars. If you had a dream about the stars or the moon, for instance, this means that this is what you've been paying attention to in your awake life. So, of course, star, the, sky, the, the sky is the limitless, which is not the limit for me. And, of course, this can pretty much represents how things are going to basically play out in your life. Be aware of the um, positioning of the moon, too. It could be a crescent moon. It could be a full moon. It could be a new moon. Be aware of these, of these energies. Because remember, when the moon waxing, you know, that's the time that basically put put out the work. When the moon waning, it's the time to basically withhold, sit back, relax. Now, if you ever dreaming about the stars, <clears throat> that means the universe is working in your favor. Your universe and the mortality of the universe is pretty much working into your favors. Especially if you're looking up to the stars at this position as well. This is going to pre pretty much play out into um, a resemblance of how you seem this reflection and of course it's good that's why it's very good to stargaze for me the more you put yourself into positions positionings of being in those energies and being in those frequencies you attract good dreams good vibes and good frequencies to basically play out into the references of your internal realms and it's very highly important to basically be aware of these things too because these things can reflect you on a totality schedule and of course the stars are important you are a star so Pretty much, if you're connecting with them, they're going to connect with you. They're going to basically come right back at you. So, dreaming of stars or stargazing in general reflects that, you know, <laughs> especially depending on how you're using the stars, too. I mean, it's one thing to basically just stare at it all day, but if you ain't got no intent behind it on what you're doing, then 10 times out of 10, you're just going to be in la-la land. But, of course, if you're using the stars for a specific reason and you're dreaming about these things and these things are pretty much working into your favor... Then that means 10 times out of 10, that's how it's going to reflect for me. Because there's one thing you could be aware of things, but if you don't have no intent behind it on what you're doing, then it's really not going to work into your favor for me. You're just going to basically be daydreaming. And of course, it's cool to daydream. That's wonderful. That's beautiful. That's brilliant. But of course, you still got the other elemental perspectives that you got to play, pretty much play out. And these elements need to be played out for me. Because if you ain't using your power, you're going to lose your power. So of course, that's how it plays out into a position. So if you're hearing about the stars, <coughs> 10 times out of 10, you're looking up to them. You feel me? And of course, what you're paying attention to, what you're paying attention to is what you're creating in your life. And of course, if you're dreaming about it, you're gonna experience it in your awake life. This is the world that you create when you go within. For me, when these eyes are shut, your internal realm is awakening and creating. And of course, if you vibrate in within, you vibrate faster outside of you. That's how shit play out. Or shit. And that's how the stars are.